This week, it's all about how to catch an idea. Ideas are amazing, sometimes magical creatures. Ideas come in all shapes, sizes, and characteristics. Some ideas are little and cute. Other ideas are big, hairy, and audacious. <laughs> they can be funny. They can be loud. They can be weird. They also can be crazy. Some ideas are serious problem solvers. Try to fix the problem. They're focused on that. Some ideas are really artistic and abstract. Well, you know what the amazing thing is though? Ideas can come at any time. And they can come from each and every person. They can come from you. And some of the best ideas come from you. In fact, this whole idea of how ideas come about and how they're born and how you catch an idea has been studied for decades and decades by the top scientists and researchers. And you know what? We're starting to learn a lot in brain science. And one of the critical things that we found out is that the brain is an amazing thing. And when you are trying to come up with the best ideas, it actually comes. The way you catch an idea is when actually you're not so focused on a task or trying to do something. <laughs> wow, what does that mean? Well, that means that, you know what? When the times when you're not actually doing something, when you're not on your tablet, when you're not on your phone, when you're actually bored, those are the times when the best ideas get born out of your brain. That's a crazy idea right there. That means that for both kids and adults, it's important to take minutes, moments in our day when we're not always constantly doing something, doing a task, being on our phone, tablet, trying to do something, always busy. That means that those times when we're able to sit just observe, be bored. Those are the times when your brain does the miraculous thing of birthing an idea. So why don't you try it out? Be bored this week, slow down, sit still, observe something, and then watch your miraculous mind do something amazing, birth an idea. Alright guys, here's the thing. I actually need to do this for myself in order to catch ideas because there's a lot of things that I would love to help out with and solve problems. So this is what I do. I actually find a place um, like this room in our house that's calm. I can look out of the windows into the trees and actually find a time when I can be awake and aware but not focused so that I'm actually looking out and I'm not really focusing on anything and I'm not really trying to think about anything in particular but just sit and let that kind of diffuse awareness just to wake me up inside So why don't you guys try it? Just take a few moments and just sit. Just observe. And just take in what's around you, but don't be focused on one thing. I'll see you next time. Bye.